Fox 61's coverage of Road to the Championship, sponsored by Riscassi and Davis. The UConn men's basketball team is finally <clears throat> in Arizona tonight, preparing for their Final Four showdown with the Crimson Tide. Like we told you last night, it was a wild ride getting there. They were stranded at Bradley for hours because of a mechanical issue with their plane. They got a Glendale after taking a red eye flight last night, so it was a late night, early morning for them. Fox 61 Sports Director Jonah Cart beat the Huskies to State Farm Stadium. He's there with more on what Dan Hurley had to say about the travel adventures. Hi, Jonah. Hi, Sarah. You're right. This time last night, UConn men's basketball was still in Connecticut. Wasn't supposed to be that way, but delay after delay, one flight issue after the next, and UConn men's basketball didn't touch down here in Arizona until around 3 a.m. local time this morning. And then just several hours after that, they arrived here at State Farm Stadium. Just a wild day, which Dan Hurley addressed in a press conference today. And here are some of the highlights. I've had a lot of thoughts because you know, I've had a lot of time. <laughs> well, I got two on the plane okay. and then I got another two at the hotel. Yeah, I mean, I ruminated uh, a lot. Um, I spiraled and then uh, I had my head in my hands a lot. It was therapeutic to watch the de-icing out the window. That was, that was probably the best part of it. Lucky to be here. We're lucky to get an opportunity to come play in the Final Four. Um, and then who doesn't deal with problems with the airlines? <laughs> Not quite sure what happened with the plane. I, um, it wasn't me. I didn't send anybody over there to, uh, to mess with the uh, mechanics. I'm sure he's uh, conjured that up in his head already. But. Uh, yeah, I did get a good night's sleep last night, so it's nice. Uh, but um, I'm sure he'll be fired up and ready to go Saturday. It'll it'll be uh, fun, and then we'll, uh, we'll we'll touch base after the game. That was Alabama coach Nate Oates at the end. UConn faces Alabama on Saturday in the Final Four, the first ever April game for the Alabama Crimson Tide. We didn't hear from the UConn players today. The open locker room session was canceled because of all the flight issues, but we'll talk to the players tomorrow. Live in Arizona, Jonah Carp, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.